G'day ladies and gents and welcome back to Cold Waters with Mags and welcome back aboard the Victor 3. So we are fully resupplied, we have all the ordnance we can possibly handle and we have a new mission. There's a fleet of ship tenders that are currently located in the East China Sea supplying warships and submarines. We need to take this group out as it's resupplying Chinese war fleets that are preparing to operate against Japan. So. We've been intercepted by a group of submarines while lurking around. Now this submarine group is not going to be our target and currently I don't think we've managed to find it. We're at 38 feet, I'm about to pop the radar just to make sure I clear all these targets. It looks like we've got a bunch of stern trawlers and a humpback. If I've misidentified anything, Raise I should the radar know in a few seconds when I don't find it on radar. Okay, so lower the radar mast. All targets confirmed, and we have the humpback, which is fine. Biologic, that one I'm pretty damn sure of. So there is at least one submarine in the area, Make and we don't know where it is. Now we are in the East China Sea, which is generally shallower, but uh, we're on the outer edges of it at this point. So we've still got 480 feet to deal with here or work with. It's better than what we get closer to the shore. It's still not great. I would, I, I prefer over a thousand feet if you can get it, but that's what we got to deal with in the Pacific. So we are going to have to lurk around and spend a little bit of time quietly hunting. I don't want to have to go to active, but again, once again, uh, so we're only ninety-seven. It's still loud, but and there is a lot of activity, but we might get lucky. Um, I'm just going to do a little bit of a troll through, spend about 10 to 20 minutes, uh, probably with some time acceleration, looking around to see what pops up. If nothing pops up after that, we're going to have to go to active and see whether or not we can actually locate these bastards and put them on the bottom. Alright, so we have had a contact and Torpedo is now in the water. Apologies, I uh, had a little bit of an interruption there, so uh, that's probably going to be missing. Anyways, um... I didn't have a chance to identify it or get its exact location, we didn't get much of a solution on it, it only popped up for a few seconds, but I'm reasonably sure it's a Han. There is a Han that is hidden somewhere in here at the moment and it is running silent. Now Hans, we've killed them before, they're not a particularly powerful submarine and they should be noisy, but because of the difficulty settings that I'm running, they're incredibly difficult. Generation 1 nuclear powered attack submarines out of China. And yeah, they should be easy to find. 152 decibels in the water, but the Victor's deaf. So ideally, I would have to go active here to confirm the target, and I possibly will. But I want to get a torpedo that's in the area first, or at least potentially give the opportunity to have the Han react against the torpedo. So I'm going to steer it around, try and drop him from the north, and I'm going to have it go active and just start banging away on its active sonar and just see exactly what happens in here. See if something makes a bit of a move. Now I'm going to put on a small bit of right rudder, not much. I want to try and turn ourselves onto a better angle to have the toad array aligned up with this area just to see exactly what pops up. And I'll do it very carefully here with just a gentle five, uh, five degree rudder turn just to try not to break the wire because I really don't want to break the wire here. All right, so 10 minutes and 27 seconds remaining on the top. And I'm going to straighten this up here. That should be good enough. All right, hard right turn, and we're going to go active on the sonar as soon as the torpedo goes active. There we go. Torpedo launch. Con we have transit. Regained contact on Sierra five bearing two four zero. So we can confirm, and yep, that is looking like a Han. I thought it was. Con sonar Sierra five is Three classified as spread. submerged submarine. They shouldn't cause us any harm, but I'm still going to put us in a 10 degree... Uh, I'm not going to have time to manage that. Come left to 
Helm, I. The left hand turn and start heading more south. Hopefully this will not interfere with our wire. At least not until the torpedo is live and on target. The Han is heading south. What's its current depth? Han sonar, noisemaker, bearing. A little two, under us. Three, it's already deploying seven. noisemakers. Wait, where are you? Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Got it. So the Han's maneuvering north for the left hand turn. It's actually about here currently. Not oh, there, it is a little bit south of where I thought. Now, is that a submarine that looks like it's shitting itself to you? That's a submarine that looks like it's shitting itself to me. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing. Overall, it's two, not actually three, a really terrible six. looking sub. Oh, regardless. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Alright, so weapon is back on. You set 80 tracking. Depth is accurate. There'll be another countermeasure drop before the torpedo gets in. It's going to try and lob the torpedo off and get it trapped in the countermeasures. The torpedoes for the or well, the counterfire has already started going active. Con that sonar, shouldn't noise maker, bearing. There's two, the countermeasure three, as predicted. Six. driving back through its own countermeasures Con, now, which is control, a smart move acquired. overall. Right, torpedo back on target. And this should be the kill shot. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra 5. Boom. Last bearing 2, 3, 7. Con helm. Steady course. So Alright, so... Target down, it was just a Han, one torpedo fired, that's perfectly fine, all going well. This is not our mission objective, of course, but we'll have to continue our hunt around the East China Sea and see what we can find. Alright, so we are in on the border of the South China Sea and the Philippine Sea. I actually think we're on the Philippine Sea at this point in time, and we're just out over the deeper water here. We are back in nearly 2,000 feet, so this is a far more comfortable amount of water to work with. Ambient noise is 93 decibels, and we have no thermal layers. Cool. Anyways, that is our current situation, and we have... We spotted via a uh, an aircraft contact, picked up a fleet coming in from the south, going between, or trying to head between Taiwan and Okinawa into the South China Sea. I don't know if this is our target, but we do have four contacts at this point, so we're going to have to start getting some IDs up here. Entirely possible this could actually be it, and the fleet wasn't in position at the time. Remember, we're hunting tenders here. Okay. It looks like a Zhang Wei. Con sonar, Sierra One Definitely is classified like as one. escort. Huh, that one's curious. I think that's a Zhang Wei as Con well. Con sonar, Sierra Two is classified as Sierra escort. Four. Too awfully high. What are you? It's a container ship. Con sonar, Sierra 4 is classified as merchant. I think it's a fucking Con Sonar Sierra 3 is classified as merchant. 
And I think there's something else here because that sonar ping seems to be coming over. Although I suppose the Zhengwei could actually be over here. That one seems to line up with what I would expect. Well now. Let's get three torpedoes ready to rock and roll. I wouldn't mind getting these in the water a little bit early. Current estimate range is 9.9 .9 kilo yards, so I want to get these out before they'll hear the transients. So, torpedo one. Shoot two one. Launch. Aye, sir. Before I fire the rest of these, bets in chat right now. Pause the video. How many wires do you think are going to break? All right, firing torpedo two. Gone fire control, we've lost the wire. There's one, and that one's not going to catch anything, I'm sorry. I was trying to keep the torpedo coming out straight so it wouldn't get, uh... Yeah, that's going to go active. Gone fire control, Two we've wire breaks, wire. firing straight out the nose. Yep, and they... <sighs> We're not doing anything, that was a dead straight shot out of the nose. Remember... The Victor 3's torpedo tubes are directly in the front, so shooting out of the nose puts no strain, while not in a turn, puts no strain on the wire whatsoever, and we've had two failures. This sink can support four wires. Two wasted torpedoes so far out of our reload. Shoot two five. Alright, so five, we've got sir. two torpedoes at the very least. All right, so torpedo one. Gone. Torpedo room tube four ready. And I'm going to let these extend out as much as possible before I turn them south. The convoy or the the group. I won't say this is the convoy. This. I was expecting more than one tender. This potentially could be the group we're after with fucking as the. The fucking. Yep. With, with this fucking thing being the um, being the submarine or the the ship tender we're after. However, I would have expected there to be more. So this may not be the fleet that we're looking for. It might Con, just happen to be room, a two, tender two, under escort. We can hope though. It would be nice if it was. And sort of disappointing. I was expecting more tonnage opportunities. Just to be sure, I'm going to drop us to 100 Make feet. Make that Hopefully one, that zero, one zero with feet, the wires. Bye -bye. So, four torpedoes in the water and two of them are going to be wasted. Active. That'll be making a lot of noise now. So I'm turning these this way because these two, while they're definitely not going to put any threat onto these, when torpedoes go active they get louder. And it's entirely possible these guys will actually hear them. Con, dive at so these one, are an estimated zero, 27 zero, dive at the moment. It's, I don't have a speed estimate for the fucking... Don't have a speed estimate for the second. It's possible they've already heard them. They seem... Oh, wait a second. No, it still seems to be heading in our direction. Time to turn the torpedoes in on targets. So five I'm going to send after Sierra 1. One is going to go after Sierra 3 as probably the best target to go for, just in case this is the group. And at the very least, that's, you know over 11,000 tons, so it's a far more valuable target. I definitely want to make sure it sinks compared to, you know, 2,000 tons. 11,000 tons. This could be the mission. Alright, so now we're going to wait till the torpedoes just close in. We've got uh, nine minutes on them. They're starting to go active now. Actually, we should activate... One, let's get five on target. So they'll start accelerating now. Uh, 
Con Sonar, Sierra 4, is classified as Merchant. Con, Fire Control, Weapon Acquired. Alright, so, Weapon 1 has acquired, it looks like Sierra 3, unless Sierra 2 is a hell of a lot closer than I'm anticipating. No contact on Sierra 1 left. Although that did just sound like a torpedo launch. That very Con much sounds new contact bearing two one two designated Sierra. We five. have a Sierra five. Is there a submarine here? Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing, two, one, two. There's a kilo. Con sonar, Sierra, five, is classified There's as a kilo. submerged submarine. Weapon one Con, found a fire kilo. Control, weapon acquired. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Alright, well we haven't detected any torpedoes yet, so hopefully the kilo has less idea than we are than we do at the moment. Con, fire control. Con, sonar, noisemaker, right. bearing, two, one, two. So the Zhang's been located. I want the Zhang taken out because the Zhang could potentially act as eyes and ears for a kilo. Now, I need to guess what this bloody kilo is. Has to be close. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Lost already due to the countermeasures, so it's hiding on the other Con, side. Con, sonar, of the noisemaker, bearing, one, eight, three. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Weapon acquired again. Con, fire in the control, water. weapon acquired. Torpedo one seems to be reacting Con, fast. Con, sonar, noisemaker, Impact, bearing, kilos two, down, one, all right. Two. Con, sonar, noisemaker, bearing, one, eight, four. Shoot tube four. Aye, sir. Shoot four out. Con, Send fire control, torpedo. weapon acquired. That was, that was just luck. Con, I had control, no idea that guy was there. Holding. I had absolutely no friggin' idea we had one of those. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Alright, five has reacquired target. The only target we've got confirmation on at the moment is the the fucking. That's the torpedo from the kilo, Con, so that's not control, even close to where we are. Only. I have no idea where the hell this one came from. Unless it was fired out of the Zhang randomly. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing, one, eight, one. Con, fire control, here, weapon so countermeasure to... homing. Five, a little bit of guidance here because it's going Con, to be a one ready. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Con, fire control, okay. weapon countermeasure homing. Guide it through these countermeasures. Con, fire control, we weapon acquired. Alright, so it should be close enough now that it takes out the Zhang with no problems. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing, one, seven, nine. Alright, manual control of the torpedo, guiding it into the hull. Damn it, moved. Guiding back. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Con sonar, back. lost contact. Sierra, one, last bearing, one, right. seven, Shang eight. Shang took one contact in the rear, so up. it's down. It'd be really nice if this just happened in a Sep Sierra 2. That would be really nice if that happened. I'm not expecting it to. Chasing down Sierra 3 is going to be hard. It's the top speed on that bloody thing. 
That's only 15 knots. No, it doesn't look like it's going to take it. Con, torpedo room, tube 5 ready. That's right, we might take it out with an anti ship missile. Send the torpedo after Sierra 2. In fact, we're going to do a low altitude, uh, low altitude launch now. This is exposing our location a little bit, but uh... We do have a torpedo that is coming in that'll uh, take care of that, I think. Check. Does it have... Yeah, and it looks like everything now has anti-missile guns in this mod. Right, so missile should be coming in just a moment. Way starting to pop up, getting a clearer look at it. Here comes the missile. Con sonar lost contact. Ooh. Sierra three, last bearing one nine one. Oh, contact great. breaking yeah, that's up. That's what I was worried about. Torpedo in the water. Possibly going to get Con, us. Sonar, torpedo in the water. Torpedo yep. in the water. Bearing zero four nine. Con sonar, we are cavitating. Con sonar, Sierra two is classified as escort. Con sonar lost. Con Passing two hundred feet. Oh, that was close. Passing we didn't have a lot of room feet. for that. Passing 400 feet. And our torpedo Con, did sonar. not... Con, sonar, torpedo in the water, torpedo in the water, bearing yeah, zero, getting two, right on. Yeah, seven. the missile may have been a bad idea. The missile may have been a bad Passing idea. Passing 700 feet. Trying to be time efficient Passing may have been a mistake. Feet. Should have just gone for a second torpedo launch. I had no idea formed. where I was. Jang Wei's bloody helicopters. It's always the goddamn helos. Passing 900 feet. Actually, it's a Shangdu. I mis-ID'd that one from the looks of it. And our torpedo is not going to hit it either, so it's Con, got free range for room, a bit. Tube four ready. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra two bearing two one five. Oh, I need to get these two torpedoes on the right side. Passing one thousand feet. Con maneuvering, making turns for three zero knots. Passing eleven hundred feet. All right. Where the hell is the other torpedo? I think we lost the first one. There's only one on us here at the moment. It's only this one.
passing 1200 feet. Con, knuckle formed. Go, I'll still on the knuckle. Con, knuckle formed. Now let's turn back and up. Passing 1200 feet. Passing 1100 feet. Passing 1000 feet. Passing 900 feet. Passing right. 800 feet. Passing 700 feet. Uh, we're probably going to pick up the other one here in a second. Yep, the one we lost. We've lost one. We lost the low one. Although, it seems to have picked up the countermeasure. So, providing we run far enough, we might be alright here. Maybe. Maybe. No, Torpedo's going to pick us back up again. Right, at least they got a little bit of a ways to catch up to us. Chengdu. 1,400 tons. Just passive radar. Huh. Looks like the helicopter's about the most dangerous thing it's actually got. Alright, so we've definitely lost one torpedo completely. We're just going to drag the other one away and get rid of it. Con, knuckle formed. Lost us through the knuckle, it's turning away. It will pick us back up again, but that's alright. I'm just trying to buy us some time at the moment. These helicopter launch torpedoes, as I mentioned a few times in the past, they don't have a particularly long shelf life. They detonate fairly quickly. They're um they're lightweight compared to the uh the tree trunks that get launched by uh by submarines, so it looks like it's just completely lost us. Rig ship for ultra quiet. There we go. All right. Now the Shengdu is currently doing twenty-eight knots. It wants no. It wants nothing to do with any of this. It's had enough. It wants out. Range is 5.6 kilo yards, so it is nice and close. We are at 10 knots. Active surface following tube one. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra 4, bearing 1, 2, 9. Torpedo out. And I want this one to activate short. I don't care about longevity. I want this torpedo moving as fast as it possibly can. It's got 15 minutes to intercept the target. And it is running away. It is flat knacker and running. Con, torpedo sure room, tube three, 3 ready. 28 knots. Uh... Yep, top speed, 28 knots. That's about as fast as it can run, and it's running in a straight line right back to China, which is over here somewhere. So, nope, we're not going to let you escape. You caused me to have a bad day. I had to actually move my submarine, so you're going to die. All right, we have intercepted Sierra 2. Con, fire control, and she's weapon acquired. she's as expected, launching countermeasures all over the shop. Well, one so far, but she'll be starting to chain them off fairly quickly. Con, sonar, noisemaker, No bearing. additional two, contacts with six, the helicopter. Five. It seems to have gone. I haven't heard it in a while, so... Hopefully it's back on the deck reloading, so when this thing hits, it goes down and that's the end of it. Let's 
Alright, turn back towards me. Make it easier. So I'm holding the um, holding position on the torpedo manually at the moment, guiding it in. I'm not letting the auto take over, so the countermeasures are not going to get the torp lost. Still have 11 minutes remaining on the torpedo, so we should be fine there. It's turning back through its own countermeasures and getting ready to drop a third one. Con sonar, there noise maker, bearing, two, six, five. make a right hand turn it's going to follow the right through and try and loop around the back of its own countermeasures so just holding its course holding its course and nope you're not going to require fine i'll guide you in Null impact. It has managed to evade the torpedo. Turn the Con torpedo. Sonar. On. Noise maker bearing two six Got eight. Past. Con fire control weapon acquired. All right, so let's have some fun here. We're going to go active. That should make it a little bit easier to locate. There it is. Now we've got feed from the torpedo itself. Boom. Lost contact. Sierra two. Last bearing two six nine. Contact breaking up. Actually, that's interesting. Sheng doesn't have an aircraft. So the the healer must have been from the Zhang. Except it's healers on the deck. So hmm. no matter. Another one bites the dust. Now, here's the interesting part. Is this actually going to be the fleet that we were searching for? Alright, so enemy engaged. Zhang Wei, the Sheng the fucking, the Kilo. The Kilo was a bonus. I was an XP. He was a sneaky bastard. I had no idea he was there. If my torpedo just didn't happen to go through that area, I, I wouldn't have found him at all. Not until he fired on me. Nine new set 80s remaining in total, because we had two launches with wire breaks. God damn it. Mission update. Good to hear you intercepted and destroyed the enemy replenishment resources. Keep up the good work. Further orders to be transmitted on this downlink. Stand by for new orders on this downlink. That was the target. It was just the fucking. All right, so we've managed to take that one out. We managed to wipe out the fleet. Now we're going to find out what our new orders are. Anyways, ladies and gents, hope you enjoyed the video, and thank you very much for watching. Cold Waters will be returning to the channel very soon, and until next time, remember to click that like button if you did, share and subscribe if you want to see more, and as always, take care.